violent crime is down over 5%. So you know, the homicide is down. Our robberies are almost even to what they were. Ag assaults are way down. What's really hurt us this year, especially the first half of uh, 2018, was car burglaries. Vehicle burglaries began early on in January. We had a lot of uh, juvenile and young men groups that were traveling from Manti to Sarasota, coming out of St. Pete, and just really uh, wreaked havoc uh, in our community here, just doing vehicle burglaries, a, a crime of opportunity, walking through neighborhoods. And uh, so we really continued to, to try to educate the public on the importance of removing your personal belongings out of your out of your vehicle. We got, you know, involved with social media, just trying to push the word out as much as we could. We made several arrests. The, the arrests are way up in, in regards to, uh, you know, vehicle thefts. But um, yeah, that hurt us in the beginning. Really, you know, it's, it's the property crimes uh, that were up the first half. I'm really proud of the men and women here at the Mandy County Sheriff's Office. You know, we had to put a lot of different groups out there, a lot of task force trying to combat this. They've done an excellent job. They are way down here in the second half of the year. We may not be able to, you know, come back and really offset the damage that was done early on in 2018, but really we're looking at property crimes as the driving force behind the increase right now. Another thing that has been a huge help to us has been video. You know, a lot of, uh, of our residents have videos now. They have the ring. You know, we, we get all of that uh, footage from them, and we can just see them walking down a street in a neighborhood just checking door handles. That's all they do. And it, it, if they find one unlocked, they go in. If nothing's there, they move on to the next vehicle.